Now, 27 storm track weather with meteorologist Alexis Clemens. Well, happy Sunday is the last Sunday of August here in 2023. You're going to want to enjoy the 70s while they're here because we are tracking just one little rain chance late tomorrow before a big warm up, I think, into Labor Day weekend. It's going to be near 90 again very soon. So the 70s, you might want to savor that while it's here, right? WKOW Tower Cam here this morning, seeing that cloud cover still hanging on this morning. Uh, so that's going to allow for some cooler temperatures, at least right now. I mean, we were we're now at 58 in Madison, Monroe. You can feel a little bit of that chill in the air there. 45 in Camp Douglas, still at 63 in Janesville. As you go through your day today, it's going to be a pretty nice one. I do expect more sunshine as we head towards the afternoon yet again, just like yesterday. Air quality is great. UV index is going to be higher later on this afternoon. And then pollen, especially weeds. Uh, we are looking at higher pollen counts through today and tomorrow because it's dry and a little breezy at times. But I do think that wind will be calmer today than it was yesterday. By about lunchtime into the afternoon should be mostly sunny for you. Calm and a comfortable day. 74 is that high temperature with a nice wind out of the northeast. And as we take a look at the picture here, the reason why we have a northeast wind is because of this high pressure system. But as the system moves to our east, Winds are going to be out of the south into tomorrow. That's going to help warm us up a little bit. Now we're just watching this little rain system here. You can see a few showers in northern Minnesota. That brings us our only chance for rain, and I think that's going to be here uh, tomorrow evening into the overnight hours. So right now we do have that cloud cover hanging on for a lot of us. But like I said, as we head towards this afternoon, more sunshine will be on the way. A lot of sunshine expected for Monday as well. It is into the late evening hours where we start to see a few little showers popping up to our north. Very isolated would lead to only a trace of rain, I would think, and then that'll move on out of here. This is a very small rain chance and it'll be gone by the time you're waking up Tuesday morning. We're into a very dry stretch ahead. In fact, of the last 10 days, only three has recorded uh, measurable rainfall and two of those was just a trace in Madison. We only have that one rain chance that we're tracking over the next seven days. Then temperatures are going to warm up. Let's take a look at this extended forecast. 80 tomorrow lows mostly in the 50s though until we head towards next weekend high temperatures in the upper 80s.